Hey everybody, Rick Needham and Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing on Monday evening, May the 7th, and this is my dayatthetrack.com thoroughbred race of the day. Let's take a look at race 9 this afternoon, folks, 3.50 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile 70 yard test on the dirt track. Three-year-old fillies race for an allowance prize of some $47,000. Contenders number 2, Wicked Miz. Number five, Don't Tango with Mango. Number four, Ride the Silver Train. And number six, Across the Track. Number two, Wicked Miz, the overall speed leader in this allowance field, racing at her about today's distance of a mile 70 yards on the dirt, has hit the board in each of her three career starts to date with her last two efforts, including a maiden breaking win in her second race back, also qualifying as power runs. Jockey Stuart Elliott and trainer Anthony Dutrow center to the post. They fit the board with 64% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number five, Don't Tango with Mango, has won two straight, including a power run win as last time out. Race nine summary, number two, Wicked Miz tops the contenders list today, which also includes number five, Don't Tango with Mango, number four, Ride the Silver Train, and number six, Across the Track, 2546 in the ninth from Mountaineer. Bonus long shots, Indiana Downs, race 7, the 9-2 shot, number 3, a deal. Qualifies as a Trackmaster plus Power Pony, takes a 7-level class drop. Nice overall speed abilities to complement for this 7.5 furlong route test on the turf. Staying here at Mountaineer, race 6, the 6-1 shot, number 2, Marble Cliff, takes a 6-level class drop. Nice overall speed abilities for this mile test on the dirt. So from Mountaineer Park on a Monday, Rick Dayton for dayatthetrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.